everybody. Hope you guys are ready to get through another lovely garage workout with me, Coach Elise, and let's waste no time and get started with a little bit of a warm up. So let's start by reaching all the way up to the sky, pinching your ears with your shoulders, hinging at the waist, bend all the way down, touch your toes. Let's walk it out and do an inchworm. Nice flat back and then back here. Touch the toes, roll it back up and then hands above your head. Really feel it stretch your lats. Squeeze and then come back down again. We'll do this five times total. And just a little bit of a warm up here. Warm up your hamstrings, your back, your arms. Stretch to the sky and I think this is the third one. I already lost count and it's only three. Halfway there. 
Turn immediately into those 50 squats. Think speed. Ten more. Nine and ten. All righty, we are with those fifty. We are on the mat with those L crunches. So hips and knees are at ninety. Hands by your face. Reach you up, tapping those heels and back. Ten more. Nine and ten. We go with that. Thirty total tricep dips. Fifteen on each leg. Bridges on each side. There goes. Triceps will get you. Alright. Push up to those heels. This first circuit's gonna be that slow burn. Not too much heavy cardio, but you know, I'm gonna feel sore tomorrow. 10 frog jumps. your leg softly. And all right. Back in the mat. 20 single leg bridges. Oh, get your heart going. Right. 
chicken noodles on that. I'm only 10 and 10 twice. <laughs> When you're done with those guys, we've got those L crunches next for 40. Hips and knees at 90. And by your face, you are lifting with your core and trying to touch the very bottom of your feet. creep towards your face, trying to keep it at 90. Mine are trying to creep. <laughs> Last reps. If you're done, grab a drink. Okay. 
kind of explain the next round. Whew. This next round, it's four <coughs> exercises. Each exercise is going to be max effort for one minute. All right, so we are doing one minute of burpees, jump up to slap knees. All right, a minute max effort of those. Or you do regular burpees, or burpees with your hand on a bench. Just keep moving, keep pushing yourself. Next, we're moving to one minute of jump roping, all right? So you have a pretend rope that you're jumping over. If you want, you can pretend that you're doing double unders, jumping up a little higher, turning those wrists twice in that before your feet hit the floor again. That'll be it for a max minute. Then the next minute, we are doing hand release push ups. Now if you really want to get fancy, you can do hand to opposite toe and then, oh, I missed my toe, and then push up as well for those badasses out there. And then our last one is going to be one minute of max ever jump lunges, or if that bothers your knees, you're going to do one minute of switchbacks, so you're not going down quite as far. Two times through with all four of those. So you have burpee to slap knees, jump roping, quote unquote, hand release push-ups, or those Scorpio push-ups, and then jump lunges. Alrighty, when you're talking about it, I'm gonna grab another quick drink. I'm gonna get ready and get excited. Count your reps if you want, and make that second round greater to, greater than or equal to your first one. Where are you calling me? Excuse me. Alrighty. Get my timer set up. Remember, we are starting with those burpees to slap knee. No rest in between, but we will take a minute break in between the rounds. Everyone ready? And go. Once if you want to just do single unders, or you can turn those just twice before your feet touch the ground. Those double unders, or you can do a combo of the two, or just jump higher. Let's see what you got. Work on those calves. We go back to singles. We are at the halfway point in our max effort minute. That's 10 seconds, we're gonna go back to those double hunters. Keep it up with your body, feel that burn. Calves are burning. All right, here we go, double hunters. I 
control that needle on the to the ground. We are halfway for me to also do those switchbacks or if you do a combo of them, keep moving. That's my big thing. much fun as I am. Trying to slow down my breathing. A little over halfway. We're about 30 seconds left before we go on for this next round. I am grateful for this one minute break. I don't know about you guys. You can also just do regular burpees too. Or again, a combo. Oh, it can be a combo. A little over halfway there. on that jump strength. The 30 second mark, let's challenge ourselves with some double unders if you're not doing them already. Ready and two wrist turns, big jumps. I'm extending more of my arms to waste more time. So I have to do more push-ups. Let's get squeeze those shoulder blades together. Try and keep have your shoulders and your butt come off the mat at the same time. As much as you can. Keep it all even. We are halfway there.
to switch to switch backs. I'm trying to keep moving. Got myself slowing down. With those jump lunges. 30 second mark right now. Trying to a couple more. Shoulders up off the mat. When you twist, you can feel this in your obliques, in your core, not in your hip flexors. If you're feeling your hip flexors, you're not pushing your belly button back to your spine. And engaging. Two, one, and we've got hip dips next in that plank position. Two, one, and side to side. And go. 
I'm just only good four seconds. the low back if you're like me on a garage floor it's not the most comfortable but it works all right bicycle crunches next everybody stay positive elbows wide nice and controlled time.